owns a restaurant in Sarasota. He does major catering. He really does understand and appreciate not only fine quality cookware, like a brand like Cuisinart, but also the tools that we need, which brings us to our Smart Stick Hand Blender. I love this item. I, I know you do. Item. And we, we spoke a little bit earlier before the show about how timely this is mm -hmm. for this time of year as we do prepare for holiday cooking. Yes, yes. Great time for making your cranberry sauce, your, so your soups pureed squashes, all kinds of things. Mm -hmm. and, and it's just a handy little machine to have. Let me pick um, this up. Yeah. Isn't, isn't it great? So we get the um, the stick, and then we also get the cup that comes yep, along the with it. Cup. And you can certainly use this in uh, right in a pot. If you're simmering a soup on the stove, that can go right inside the pot. Really? Even um, something hot? Oh, yeah. Because it's stainless. Yeah, mm -hmm. absolutely. So that's perfect. Yeah. I know that there are other models that are out there that you can't do that with because they're made of like plastics right. and other things. So that is a nice advantage. Yeah, and again, the sanitariness of, of stainless steel. That's right. You know, a, a metal shaft. The one that's not going to break and, and uh, doesn't have the, the, the plastic, <laughs> plastic that can break on us, yes. And so simple. It's really a two-part machine. There's a little button to release that, and this comes off. This is dishwasher safe. Mm -hmm. Obviously, you don't want to put the motor in the dishwasher. That, that pops off separately. Yeah, but that's nice and but, easy. I like yeah, that. clicks right on and off. Mm -hmm. And if it's not quite click kicked on, the motor won't start. So you know that it's safe. It's going to click in place sure. and it's going to work. All right, let's and then show one little you. Button. Yeah, and we're going to show you. Now, certainly our show is called Holiday Cooking, mm -hmm. but this can be every day. We were talking about the cranberry and all mm -hmm. the soups, the carrot soups and the pumpkin soups that many of us are going to prepare. So this is going to come in handy for you. I'm looking at some of the special incentives that we have on pricing, free shipping, and handling. Well, mm. you don't you don't ever go wrong there. <laughs> that's, so that's if you're in thing. need of a, a hand blender, a lot of people love these because they're grab and go. Yeah. No mm -hmm. fuss, no muss. It's you know it's kind of easy to store in a cabinet, yeah, kitchen small, drawer. Yeah. Small, quick job. Sometimes sure. you need to pull out the big, big uh, food processor, yes. but but a lot of times this is uh, just really simple and easy to grab hold of. Um, we're gonna make a, a balsamic vinaigrette dressing. We can buy this in a bottle for a lot of money, and it won't be nearly as good as if you put a little fresh basil. Fresh clove of olive oil, or fresh clove of garlic, excuse me, and then slowly add your olive oil. Most dressings are about one part vinegar to about three parts oil, and it creates a perfect emulsion, so you get a nice thick dressing. It's not separated with your oil floating on top. Everything all blends together nicely. Grind up the garlic and the basil all at the same time, so there's no that chopping, no fuss, so no fragrant and delicious. And again, when you go to take it out, just pop that loose. And I often just take this and just rinse it under the under the faucet under and the get faucet. it clean real mm -hmm. quick. You don't even need to go into the dishwasher with it, but but you certainly can. Well, look at how great that yeah. is. Yeah, and you get a nice creamy dressing. This holds up in the refrigerator for several weeks. It should not separate on you with the way that emulsifies, but if it does, again, pull the stick out and just give it one little sh quick shot. Food processing really goes in seconds. It's not it's not a matter of two or three or five minutes. It's ten or fifteen seconds, and you've got your result. Uh, if if your product is good, if it does yes. what it's supposed to do. But it's so essential, you know. I, most people, and not everyone, when you're cooking for Thanksgiving, you're mm -hmm. cooking perhaps for a lot of people. Sure. Probably more people than you do any other time of the year. And so it's not uncommon that every burner on the stove is taken up, mm -hmm. and that you're preparing. Gosh. I don't know. Some people do, you know, three types of meats, even more, or, you know, the dressing and the cranberry and the macaroni and cheese and whatever it is that you make in your family that's customarily. That's it's, so really, it's really this part, the prep, that takes the longest. And so I always say, why not have those tools near you and that are convenient for you to be able to do the hard stuff and make those hard jobs ordinarily easier. And that's what this really does. In seconds, you know, you can create something that's flavorful, that's fresh. So many of you are changing your diet. You're really trying to incorporate a lot more fresh foods. Yeah, beautiful and pesto sauce. Look how, and certainly, you can buy pesto sauce in the department store, I mean, the grocery store. It's expensive. It's, it's expensive. very expensive. Yeah. And it's, it doesn't still have that same kick. You, there's just a difference in the level of freshness, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, salsas. You want to make your own fresh salsa. Same again, thing with salsa. You I mean, I've, a lot I've of purchased money. it in the grocery store before, but it's still, again, not the same as if you pop in the fresh garlic, the onion, the peppers, the cilantro, mm -hmm. you know, it all kind of goes in there. I think the thing that keeps us from making it fresh at home is that we don't have the simple quick grab to products so that it, it doesn't come become this, you know, long process, this drawn-out process. We want it to be fast and easy. Sure, and you start to think about having to uh, chop and dice all these ingredients and you go, oh, it's too much yeah, work. I don't have time. Let me go over to the grocery yeah, store and pick it up. Forget about it. Chunk it up, throw it in, and uh, the machine and will... And you're in. Look at that. 
We'd love for you to be able to shop with us for it. Take a look at this. Don't forget this speaker is included. It's a 16-ounce speaker. And if you're curious about the wattage, it's a 200-watt motor. And uh, a $29.95, cool gift to give to someone. How many of you have different types of shakes, whether it's protein shakes? What about baby food? Baby food, sure. You know? Make your own. Why buy the, yeah. the, all the you want chemicals and all those other things? Just so if they, you have maybe a little one and you want to maybe um, buy maybe some of the fresh vegetables, um, carrots. I'm thinking peas. Mm -hmm. A stand mix, a stand, a smart stick like this will be so perfect for you to be able to puree and and make it fresh. A lot of you don't want the additional preservatives and other ingredients that they put in baby food. With this, you can certainly have it. By the way. I wanted to oh, show you my bear. Who's here, speaking of babies? <laughs> <laughs> I want you to see this bear because we have launching coming up soon at HSN, and I'm looking for the exact date. Oh, here we are. Let me just tell you. Is that right? I think you're right. Well, first of all, today is National Bring Your Bear to Work Day, mm -hmm. and it says um, Bring Your Bear to Work Day, and beginning on October 24th at 10 a.m., and 9 p.m. Eastern Time, Boyd's Bears are going to be joining the community at HSN. So mark your calendar, October 24th is the date, at 10 a.m. and 9 p.m. So just wanted to kind of give you a little sneak peek of that. Hmm. And as we go back to our smart stick, give us a call if you've used this, if you'd like to have it. And even with the ice, that's something, you know, making the fruit smoothies that sure. a lot of us love to have. It's powerful enough with a 200 watt motor for you to be able to take ice and be able to create those drinks. Coffee drinks, a lot of you like to have. Um, maybe you like to add a little snow. All perfect. We're going to wrap up our presentation, though. And I want to thank Chef Paul for being here. I know he's back this afternoon, I believe, in the 4 p.m. hour. 4 o'clock, we'll be back. Mm -hmm. So please stay tuned. If you're around at 4 p.m., we'd love to have you back. Our item number is 721907. We want to remind everybody about that 20 piece cookware set that a lot of you took advantage of. And certainly stay with us because more planned for you and this great hour.